Damon Targaryen vs Jon Snow. House of the Dragons Matt Smith weighs in on imaginary ancestral fa. Matt Smith who portrays Damon Targaryen in House of the Dragon has weighed in on an imaginary face-off between him and Jon Snow from Games of Thrones deciding who would win in an ancestral battle. Damon is currently the husband of Rhaenyra Targaryen preparing her army for the upcoming civil war in House of the Dragon Season 2. As for Jon he was a major character in the parent series later revealed to be carrying Targaryen blood. This makes Damon one of his many ancestors from the prequel but both of them formidable fighters. Speaking on The Tonight Show starring Jimmy Fallon Smith weighed in on who would win in a battle between Damon from House of the Dragon and Jon from Game of Thrones. At 4.59 Fallon asks which character would win in a fight the actor saying Damon would win because he has a dragon. Check out what Smith had to say about the imagined battle below. Come on man Jimmy. Who would win in a fight between Jon Snow and Damon? Mate I've got a dragon. I've got a dragon. Listen I've got a lot of respect for Jon Snow. Jon Snow's a bad boy don't get me wrong. Kit Harrington, lovely man. Lovely guy I have a lot of respect. But don't get it twisted I would F him up. I've got a dragon. Both Damon and Jon have proven themselves capable characters in their respective shows whether a dragon is involved or not. In just season 1 of the prequel series the Targaryen Prince has proven himself a formidable tactician as well as a brave warrior willing to put his life on the line for the sake of his allies. The same bravery can be found in the former King of the North who faced countless battles with a similar level of skill throughout his series. While fighting with a dragon would easily make Smith's character the winner of their battle hand-to-hand -hand combat could see the pair at a draw. The Game of Thrones ending proves its hero is willing to sacrifice even that which he loves most for the sake of the world something that aligns with his tenacity in battle. The Battle of the Bastards proved how difficult it can be to stop him once he's decided he must fight. Damon however is much more patient and calculated analyzing his opponent before striking when he finds a weak spot. However the key difference between them is the level of experience each has in battle. While Jon has been in countless fights throughout Game of Thrones his opponent is one of the most experienced tacticians in House of the Dragons cast. Because of the years of experience he has in comparison even without a dragon Damon just might be able to come out on top in a fight. Yet it would be close because if he underestimates his enemy's tenacity in battle then he would be more liable to fall. All episodes of Game of Thrones and House of the Dragon are streaming on Max. House of the Dragon Season 2 begins on June 16. Source, The Tonight Show starring Jimmy Fallon slash YouTube. We want to hear from you. Share your opinions in the thread below and remember to keep it respectful. Half a decade after The Big Bang Theory wrapped up its run the young Sheldon finale fixes Penny and Leonard's frustrating pregnancy storyline. Prime Video is now streaming Callum Turner's The Boys in the Boat and those who enjoyed that film should check out Turner's other historical project. In an interview with TMNT, Last Ron and co-writer Tom Waltz hinted at the potential for more stories set in the alternate continuity. Paul Giamatti's weirdest role ever was over 20 years ago and it has some surprising semi-all rights with his performance in The Holdovers. Poison Ivy has officially died and her final moments with Harley Quinn are so heartbreaking they'll destroy every fan of their relationship. After all these years National Treasure 3 needs a nostalgic hook to get audiences back on board and Sean Bean's villain would be just the thing. The Jedi Order is back and in full swing in the Acolyte but 100 years prior to the Star Wars prequels this show's Jedi Order is very different. We want to hear from you. Share your opinions in the thread below and remember to keep it respectful. This thread is open for discussion. Be the first to post your thoughts.